Hey everybody, Justice Good here, and today I'm going to show you how to create a Photoshop star trail effect with a built in preset that's new to Photoshop CS5. If you head over to Window and open your Actions panel, this is where we'll be working. What actions are, if you're not aware, is a set of pre made steps that you can just click play on and Photoshop will take your image through all these steps. So I was searching through some of the presets that come new in Photoshop CS5 and I found this cool one called Star Trails. Again this won't be in the older versions of Photoshop so you have to have CS5. But if you head over to this little arrow you'll see one of them that's called Star Trails. And if you go ahead and click that it will open up the preset for you to play in a little folder. Now don't worry about all these, these are just the steps that it takes it through. All you have to do is click on the original Star Trails rotation action there. So click that with your layer selected and go ahead and click play. Again, use an image of stars because that's what this is for to give you this effect right here. A pretty awesome looking star trail effect that looks like uh, you left your camera on and the exposure of the stars rotating created this effect. Now if you have a slower computer this might take a little bit longer but it has a lot of steps in the action. So let me just demonstrate this again on a different picture of some stars. Click the star trails rotation go ahead and click play and it automatically takes your image through these steps and there you have a pretty cool looking final effect for you to do what you want with. You can even play the action over and over on the effect to make it have an even stronger rotation. Again, play around with some of the presets that Photoshop has. They have some pretty cool actions. Um, most of them, to be honest, are cheesy, but I thought this was a pretty cool addition. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this tutorial, check out my previous tutorials and don't forget to subscribe for more. And I'll see you next time.